Once upon a time, in a small village nestled amidst the lush green mountains, there lived a wise old Buddhist monk named Dharmapala, known for his wisdom and compassion. He had dedicated his life to spreading teachings that brought peace and enlightenment to those around him. People from far and wide would come to seek his guidance and learn from his profound wisdom. One sunny morning, as the village bustled with life, a young man named Ravi arrived at the monastery seeking the monk's advice. Ravi was a kind-hearted soul who had recently experienced a great betrayal. He had trusted someone who turned out to be fake and it had left him shattered and disillusioned. Colon with a heavy heart, Ravi approached Dharmapala, hoping to find solace and guidance. The wise monk welcomed him with a warm smile and invited him to sit down. Ravi poured out his heart, explaining how he had trusted his friend only to be betrayed in the most unimaginable way. Tears streamed down his face as he spoke, revealing the depth of his pain. Dharmapala listened attentively, his kind eyes reflecting the young man's anguish. After a moment of silence, he spoke softly, Ravi, my dear friend, the journey of life is filled with both joy and sorrow. Along the way, we encounter people of all kinds, and not all of them have pure intentions, but there is a way to discern the genuine from the fake. Ravi leaned closer, eager to learn the wisdom that Dharmapala was about to impart. To identify fake people, one must first cultivate self-awareness and develop the ability to see beyond appearances. Just as a tree's true nature is revealed by the quality of its fruits, a person's true character can be discerned by their actions and intentions. Ravi nodded, absorbing every word with earnest attention. Dharmapala went on to tell Ravi a parable about two young travelers who had set out on a perilous journey through a dense forest, along their path, they encountered an elderly man who appeared weak and feeble, asking for their help. One traveler, driven by compassion, offered his assistance, while the other turned his back, consumed by his own selfish desires. As they ventured deeper into the forest, a sudden storm broke loose. The traveler who had helped, the old man found shelter in a cave, while the other was left to fend for himself, in the cave. The compassionate traveler discovered a hidden treasure more valuable than he could have ever imagined. The other traveler, filled with envy and greed, perished in the storm. Dharmapala paused, allowing the profound meaning of the parable to sink into Ravi's heart. He then continued, Ravi, the story illustrates that genuine people are driven by compassion, selflessness, and empathy. They are willing to lend a helping hand without expecting anything in return. On the other hand, fake people are guided by selfish motives, often hiding their true intentions behind a facade of friendliness. Ravi pondered over the lesson, realizing that he had failed to see the signs that could have alerted him to his friend's true nature. Dharmapala assured Ravi that recognizing fake people was a skill that could be developed over time. He advised him to observe people's actions, paying close attention to their consistency, integrity, and the way they treated others. Genuine people, he explained, would consistently display kindness, honesty, and loyalty, even in the face of challenges. The young man felt a renewed sense of hope as he absorbed Dharma Palo's teachings. He realized that his experience with the fake friend was not in vain but rather a valuable lesson that would strengthen his discernment in the future. Days turned into weeks, and Ravi continued to visit the wise monk, eager to deepen his understanding of identifying fake people. Dharmapala shared more stories, teachings, and practical exercises to sharpen Ravi's discernment. The young man immersed himself in the teachings, embracing the path of self-awareness and compassion. Months passed, and Ravi's ability to identify fake people grew stronger. He learned to trust his intuition and observe the subtle signs that revealed someone's true character. The village noticed a change in him as he became a pillar of strength and wisdom, guiding others who had fallen victim to fake people. One sunny afternoon, Ravi returned to the monastery to express his gratitude to Dharmapala, with a smile on his face, he said, Venerable monk, your teachings have transformed my life, I have learned to see beyond the masks that people wear, 
and I am now surrounded by genuine friends who uplift and support me, Ravi, my dear friend, the ability to discern fake people is a lifelong journey, remember, the true treasure lies not in finding fault with others, but in cultivating the qualities of kindness, compassion, and integrity within yourself. By embodying these virtues, you will attract genuine people into your life, filled with gratitude, Ravi bowed before the wise monk, acknowledging the profound wisdom he had gained. From that day forward, Ravi dedicated himself to spreading the teachings of Dharmapala, inspiring others to develop discernment and embrace a life filled with genuine connections. The village flourished as its people grew closer, united by the bonds of authenticity and genuine friendship. And so, the story of Ravi and Dharmapala spread far and wide becoming a timeless tale of wisdom and guidance.